All right, man, it's getting ready to watch uh, Skinwalker Ranch, episode three. So, a couple minutes out, just getting prepared. So, let's watch this. Yeah! So, uh, orange yellowish shaped craft to the freaking catamulations to the petroglyphs on the wall so what's going on with this damn ranch all right man so a lot to get in with this uh so they're gonna introduce um john anderson and he worked with bigelow in the 1990s when bigelow bought the ranch and um during that whole time uh Bigelow never um, really released anything that happened on that ranch. It's all certified. Um, but pretty much what happened there was, you know, obviously everything that we talked about, paranormal activity, mutilations, and all that crap. So, and then um, John Anderson says that, you know, there at the old homestead, uh, there would be like this ball of light that would like get a little bit bigger and bigger. And then, um, then it would go away. And then they would see a figure, like, you didn't say Bigfoot, but like you could say you would see something that would pretty much come out of that, out of that portal. And um, that happened twice. And then there was, um, it happened at back behind Homestead too by the, the house there. So, and then at one time, um, this is with, um, not NIDS, it, yeah, with NIDS, with Bigelow's team in the, in the 90s when they were observation the whole camp they uh at one time there was like it was at night or something but they saw um a, a guy with a gun he had a rifle and there was something in a tree a little bit far away and with the scope like he shot it and he said it fell down and then like then it vanished and when they went there um there was a track of like a raptor so this is something else that was um you know never never seen or you know never really heard about so we're getting some more like uh stories that's happened there like from the past um they're telling that and then we're gonna go into um what john anderson thinks it is and uh pretty much he says he thinks it's a portal so you know portals opening up and um with multi dimensions and so, uh, and Travis, you know, even talked about how, like, his kind of theory maybe it was a, a wormhole, a wormhole, as in, um, last, the last, uh, season. And they kind of go in a little bit of scene about that. And so, um, yeah. And then, uh, they're going to go ahead and do, like, uh, how can we find these wormholes? And we're going to do a laser grid. And then, um, you know, uh, let's find a good point pretty much on the ranch and the best part on the ranch is in the southern part of it so um they're going to build a little tower over there and then it's going to it actually shows the whole ranch and um so you know we're going to see what they're going to what's going to happen with this experiment all right man so um they're going to introduce some new cows into the ranch and then they're going to go ahead and put some tags on them some biosensor tags so they know where they are always um, cause remember if last season they shot up, uh, they showed up like a little UFO above the cow that died. And so, and all the other cows kind of ran away. So they want to like track this, um, in the future and see if something like that happens. And then they're going to go ahead and bring the, uh, the portal team, like the, the portal, the razors, the lasers in to see if they can, um, you know, find any portals and they ask the guy, are you ready to look for some portals? He's like, I've never done that before. And they're gonna go and wait until the sun goes down and then um, they're gonna go to the observation point over there on the southern point of the ranch and they're gonna show these lasers and damn, these lasers were so cool looking, man. They are like big, bright blue, like um, awesome. Cause if you remember last year when they shot the one, really strong laser at the mesa and then it obviously then it like split into two so um we're gonna see you know what the hell is gonna go on with this laser all right man so charles you know he wants to show him where um he's the you know the officer back in the day that was um running around the ranches over there and he went to us and 
this is another academy relation that happened on the ranch that he reported to and they sh he wants to show him where that happens and the crew wants to see maybe if it happens kind of where um the other one happened last year but um it's not there so there's they just pass that on um but he says you know all the organs were removed um there was no blood and there was no burn marks um Looked like there was a lot of matted grass, is what he said. Something like heavy was down there. And to him, it looked like it was almost like a spaceship that landed there. And uh, now you want to look, and then they kind of want to show, like, what what is going on with the U.S. government, um, with ATIP, and then, you know, researching the UFOs and putting all the money in there. And it this uh, report that happened... Back in the day, um, here with Charles, is kind of like some of the same reports that are happening now, today, you know. And so we're going to go ahead and get into, we're going to get into the, here we go, let's get into Night 2, Homestead 2, Laser Grid, Optical Blast, let's see what we got, you know, they're going to start, sh you know. Shooting up. Let's see if we can see some portals, um, some orbs, because this is what happens here at Homestead too. Um, they're gonna have night vision cameras. They're gonna have uh, thermal vision cameras, and let's see if something crazy here is gonna happen. And uh, you know they like to just like lead you on, but this 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 show's pretty damn good, man. Like. I live in Utah, and uh, I don't live too far from the ranch. I mean, I can get there right, right now in a couple hours if I really wanted to. But you don't want to do that, guys. Don't go there because they're locked down, dude. Dragon will shoot you. You will. All right, man. Then we're going to go ahead and prepare for the night of freaking the lasers on part two. And um, they're getting prepared. They're shooting lasers. And Eric's little beeper thing goes off, and it's got, like lightning indications that's happening around them and he's like oh man this is ha happening all day and i've even went and reset it and now it's happening again and then freaking um they're like what's going on over there with the uh if you see any lightning in the side in the skies or anything and he's like no but like the thermal showing like really hot temperature above where you guys are at and um, so Thomas and Eric, um, they go ahead and move a little bit away because they want to get a better view of kind of where the laser is. So there's two different point of views. And so they split up in like, you know, twos, threes, whatever. And then so, um, they're over there shooting the lasers and they're at Homestead 2. And, and they're like, did you just feel the temperature dropped? And they said it dropped like 10 degrees. And then, um, right then too, they, uh, they were, Travis said like, oh, did you smell that? And so they smelled something crazy. And then, so Thomas and Eric are out there in a little bit of ways. And they're like, do you see the light in the sky over there? And so they're like trying to look for it. And, um, it's in the West. And, uh, they said it kind of like, it looked like a flash, a couple flashlights go on and off. All right, let's wrap this up with final thoughts. And um, it's 12.45 a.m. there at the homestead and south of the tower. They they see something like lights and it's gone. So um, a lot of kind of strange things are happening with these laser grids. So with this experiment that they did, um, they're going to check the data. But it kind of looked like, it, like something happened and maybe those lights that they did show, they didn't really show up with what they saw. They said that it could have been one of those portals opening up. And like I said, this is all about portals. Um, this is, show is a mystery. And there's a lot going on at that ranch. I really don't think um, that it's all make-believe or just making this crap up. I don't know if any of you think that. But what I think is uh, a lot of it's true. Maybe they're fabricating some of it. I, I think they're fabricating the time. I don't think that they're making any of it up. I just don't think that it's happening. Like, uh, I think they've been filming out there for a while. And uh, we're getting, like, you know, bits and pieces of it. And maybe, I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. But uh, I really do enjoy it. And this 
Shit, sorry, I just reviewed a song and I'm rambling, so later.